Hello and welcome. This is the second and final video regarding the improvements I made to the Edge 300 power amplifier. Firstly, thank you all who have watched the first video. Secondly, the disclaimer, and that is, please note, if you decide to perform the alterations I did, you do it at your own risk and no one else can be held responsible for your actions. And this is with regard to any harm to personal property, so please remember, you're on your own. Since the first video, I have only made one additional alteration, and that is that I have soldered the outgoing signal wires directly to the rear of the binding posts. And as you can see, there is a small board located at the rear of all the binding posts. On the board, there are a number of small capacitors and resistors, and these are working as sonic filters, so that's the reason why I kept the board located in its original position. When installing the board and tightening the nuts, be careful so you don't over tighten the nuts and damage the board and the circuitry within it. As I've been using these Edge 300 power amplifiers for quite some time now in my system, I can only say that I'm extremely pleased with the performance I receive. And the difference between the original ones and these improved ones is very close to absurd. And I wouldn't hesitate to perform these alterations once again. Thank you for watching and bye for now.